Welcome to ScienceWorks. My name is Douglas, and today I am going to be making some bubbles. Now, at home, you might have pre-made bubble mix. If not, that's okay, because we are going to link with this video our very own bubble juice recipe. Now, once you've got that all sorted out, that bubble juice, all you need is, well, you might have a bubble wand. And bubble wands are all pretty much the same. They're just an opening where you get some of that bubble juice, add air, and you make bubbles. But you don't need these. What are other things that we can make bubbles with? Well, maybe with a little help, go looking around the house for something that has an opening. Maybe like these scissors right here. Make sure you're nice and careful. Do they make good bubbles? Oh, they do. Something else that you might have around the house that has an opening, one of these. I wonder if that makes a good bubble. Not really. Oh, lots of little tiny openings. It's just a fly swatter. Lots of bubble juice on there. Now I could blow the air through, or another way I can get air is Tiny bubbles. Something else that we made here at ScienceWorks, this is just a bottle with the bottom cut off. We've taped some cloth on the end, dip that in the bubble juice, add the air, bubble snake. I wonder how long of a bubble snake I can make. In fact, you don't need any special equipment to make a bubble. You can use your hands. Make an opening with your fingers, dunk it in, get plenty of bubble juice, add the air, and maybe even try to catch that bubble as a runaway bubble. There we go. Caught the bubble. We'd love to see all your bubble making devices. To share with us, all you have to do is Post it on social media, hashtag ScienceWorks. Until next time, bye-bye.